Hello all you coin aficionados out there and welcome to the DC Coin World International Coin Channel. Today we're going to take a look at the one pound coins from Great Britain, the coins that replaced the one pound banknote. And we see a few of them here and we'll look at these in subsequent videos. Um, and uh, we'll talk about what's on the back of them and what they represent. But we're going to start today with this coin right here. And this is the first of the one pound coins. Uh, it came out in 1983. And you can see these are really hard to light just because, let's see if we can get that light a little bit better. Let me try this one too. I'll turn this little super light off. No, I'm going to leave that one on and leave it right like that. Okay, so the coin is a nickel brass coin and it came out in 1983. It's also uh, a circulating commemorative, and the front of it, or the obverse, which we're looking at right here, says DG Reg FD 1983, um, by the grace of God, Queen, uh, Defender of the Faith 1983, that's the Latin inscription for that, it says Elizabeth, I, I, Elizabeth II, and she is wearing the Girls of Great Britain and Ireland tiara. And these coins are pretty heavy coins. They weigh 9.5 grams. They're 22.5 millimeters in diameter and 3.15 millimeters in thickness. If we tip these coins up, it's kind of interesting. Oh, I should say that this, of course, is the Arnold Machen um, engraving, uh, the second portrait of Queen Elizabeth. If we tip the coin up, we see that it has an engraving around the edge. And what it says is Decus, D-E-C-U-S, et, E-T, and T-U-T-A-M-E-N, Tutaman, uh, in ornament and a safeguard. That's what it says around the edge of this coin. And it has, uh, you can see the cross here, and then it it just, says, it's a, it just says it once, but it goes all the way around, and then it has a kind of a space here, and you see it's somewhat of a reeded edge, and then there's the cross here. Now, um, it's called Mill with Incu's Legend, or kind of inset legend. And then when you get to the back, oops, the other back, um, you see uh, why this is such a, an interesting coin. And on the back, we have the Royal Arms. And the Royal Arms here, uh, it's called the Royal Arms with Supporters. And guess who the supporters are? Um, if we can get it set up right. We, on this side here, we have a lion. And on this side here, we have a unicorn. Now, when these came out in 1983, and, and I should tell you how many they made. In 1983... When they first came out, they made 443 million of these. So there's a ton of them out there. They, they made almost half a million uncirculated and 108,000 almost proofs. So this coin is never going to have any value in this condition other than its uh, street value, which is about $1.25 in exchange value. In other words, you can spend it still. Um, the... Uh, Royal Arms on this one actually was used not just in 83, but it was used in 93, 98, 2003, and 2008. So just because you find one with the Royal Arms on the back and the supporters, um, it doesn't mean it's a 1983. This all, the coin was also made in uh, 90, I mean, yeah, 93, 98, 2003, and 2008. So you can't judge this one by the back. You actually have to look back onto the front and if we look at this one, we can't read all of the inscription that's on here. But if you look right down here, it actually says something across here. It says, uh, Dio et mon droit. And it also says uh, up here, and you can't read this either, it says, Oni soy qui mal y pense. And so there are two different um, sayings or 
uh, inscriptions on here. And on this one, it's incredibly hard to read. Chances are you may want to get a little bit later uh, version of this. And I can show you one. This is actually the, oh, actually this is a better 83. So let's take a look at this. No, not much better. You can just see that there's a little bit more words. Let's see if we find one that has a little bit more of the engraving on it. Ah, so this one you can see some of the uh, words here and some of the words here. So, okay, this is the Royal Arms of uh, the United Kingdom. On the back, you see it has the um, beaded inner rim. And this is the 1983. And this, it's a shield with a crown atop it, surrounded by the Order of the Garter motto, which is here. And then down here, it, it says uh, the, uh, the banner motto, Dieu et mon droit. And when you tip these up, you can get a little bit better view of them if you can read it. But in this one, I think this one is a little too far gone for us. So there you have it, the 1983 first one pound coin from Great Britain. And you can see how these get scratched and beat over the years. Now I understand that this is a coin that is uh, 36 years old and it has 36 years of use. So if you look at it from that level, it's still uh, in pretty great shape. Okay, we'd love to have you subscribe to our channel, the DC Coin World International Coin Channel. And if you have any comments, please leave them in the comments section.